This is a special report. Folks, there's something we all need to be aware of. Um, I'm about to show you some data, and by the way, this came from you, the subscribers that uh, have actually turned me on to this, and so I thank you. Folks, it appears that our solar system has entered into what I will call a, I don't know if it's a debris field is the right term. All we do know is this is, and I'm going to show you so you'll actually see the data yourself. There are a lot of near-Earth objects popping up literally today. Um, you will see what I'm talking about. And when you see all these little arrows, Folks, those are comets. They're becoming much more numerous. Uh, this is the latest one I pulled up for you. We're discovering more and more new comets all the time. Our early warning uh, defenses have pretty much um, alerted us to this. By the way, I will give you a link on this one. You need to watch this comment right here, uh, amongst many others. And again, you can see these are the ones that we continually know about, Hell, Bop, Haley's. I mean, these are the ones that we have traditionally seen. But it's like the heavens have almost begun to open up and really have just begun to explode. Now look at this. This is the latest data off the JPL's website. I'll leave the link for you. But you can just see, look at this, folks. This is just crazy. Now check this out. So here I am right here at uh, the NASA website. This is the Near Earth Prod. This is the one that tracks them. Here's what we've had here recently. AU, remember, is a astronomical unit or basically distance between here and the uh, sun. I always round it off to 100 million miles, and you can do the, uh, the math. But check this out. Look at this. Let's just stop here and look at some of these. Uh, January 13th, 14th, 14th, 15th, 15th, 16th. Now, we can look at these distances, and folks, some of these are pretty close. <laughs> uh, a lunar distance, LD. 250,000 miles, so you can really begin to kind of do the, the math, but look at this. Here's the one we were talking about earlier. I mean, all of these are, for the most part, very close. I mean, they really are um, surprisingly close. And this just goes up to February 17th. I mean, look at this. This is not just me saying, hey, there's something going on. Or, you know, a half a dozen subscribers writing me within an hour. Something's up with that. I had mentioned uh, about this 2016 WF9. <sighs> Listen, all I'm doing is reporting to you so you can be informed yourself. There is something really going on. Now check this out. This is the fireball report. This is what citizens report of seeing meteorites, um, you know, shooting stars. But these, look at this. And these are all over the world. You can see these events. I'll leave the links below, but they go on for pages, pages, folks. I mean, this is not just a page. It goes on for pages. Look at the dates. All of them are today. Yesterday, excuse me. This one here is today. So we know that something is definitely afoot here. When you begin to get all of this and... The diagrams I was pointing out to you, actually, as you can see for yourself, here they are. 
I mean, you know, you could take one perspective and say, well, this almost looks like <laughs> shooting fish in a barrel. I don't know. It, it, it just seems a little odd to me that we're seeing such a heavy, heavy saturation, concentration, magnitude. Pick your word. It's obviously that something is going on. I will leave these links because, as I said, I think we may very well, we, we've, we've heard about potentially this cloud. We know. We, we've seen it. We've seen it on SETI. We've seen it on SDO. We are in a cloud. I, now, I don't know if it's a debris cloud. I don't know if it's a gas cloud. It's obviously something. The amount of incoming debris is becoming to the point where I think we really have moved into another region of space that uh, uh, very crowded. Again, you can see what I'm talking about. Now, I found this interesting. I went back, and the great thing about when you begin to look at back at some of this data, folks, we seem to have had a little bit of a warning ahead of time. But then again, the trolls came out and said, well, all of this is just nonsense. Well, maybe not. Who knows? Uh, all I'm doing is putting this out for you. Keep yourself safe. Be kind to one another, and I'll leave the links.